Hi, welcome back to my vlog, Jabeth World. My name is Jenny. I hope everyone is doing okay. I wish everyone good health. And um, please take your vaccines and keep safe. This is my first time to do a makeup video. It's called the Get Ready With Me vlog. And I actually don't know how to film it earlier, but I decided to wake up in the morning to get the natural light. I think it's best. And so I tried. I woke up around 4 p.m. Normally I'm, I'm awake around 6 uh, because of my work. So I think I was able to do it earlier. Yeah, I, I think I was able to do it. So I, I just want to share this. Uh, get ready with me video. It's about my routine, my makeup routine. I always start with moisturizing my skin, and I use this green aloe vera hydro gel. It leaves a coolness in the skin. And I always feel refreshed whenever I use this aloe vera hydro gel. And we have to leave it for 5 minutes until it dries up before we put another serum or moisturizer on the skin, depending on you. So after 5 minutes, we're going to put this essence or serum on my face this also keeps my skin moisturized and protects my skin from pimples or acne i normally have breakouts if i continually use foundation in my face and ever since i discovered this one i have less acne and my skin is more healthier too so it's just easy to apply and we'll leave it for another two minutes to dry it up and we'll start the makeup thing <laughs> checking my skin so look it's more healthier now and we will now start the foundation so this is the product i'm using it's called Maybelline New York Fit Me and it's classic ivory. They have like the number for your skin tone. So I have one with 120. So this one is good for normal to oily skin. And I really like this one and it also have the same color, exact color of my skin. So I like using it. So this sponge is from Mary Kay. I had an extra sponge. And so I wanted to use it just for this video. So normally I blend this with my skin for about two minutes. It's easy and for other people, there are brands that they can try as well depending on their skin type and what their uh, skin wants or like and this is what I like because it gives me less pimples and also less oil on my face so this is the one that I'm buying for for about a year now I've been using this one and it's nice on my skin as well Okay, there you go. Done with the foundation. And let's do the eyebrows. So I'm going to use the dark color because my hair is dark. I'm just going to blend it with the line on my eyebrow. So this is how I draw this eyebrow every day before going to work. Now it's less because I'm I'm just staying at home <laughs> so you, nothing really special all you have to do is just follow the line and just draw along with it see 
there I don't do anything and I'm using this small brush because I've been using this small brush for a long time now and I just like it because um, it's it's um, easier for me to draw the brush is very convenient for me to use so let's do the other one okay same thing just follow the lines I really don't know how to uh, do the eyebrows other people have this good and pointy eyebrows <laughs> and I watch a lot of videos on this but still I'm not able to follow so I'm just going to do whatever I want in my eyebrows normally this will just take um, two minutes to three minutes depending um, depending on how my eyebrows look like because this is like the critical part <laughs> there that's how i make my eyebrows pointy there <laughs> all right my brows are done and so this is my favorite part there my eyeshadow palette so this is my favorite part i love coloring my eyes and i wonder what i'm going to use maybe um a little bit of pink will do yeah let's use this brush yeah that these two colors i'm going to combine them so let's start i'm not really good at this so i'm just going to put them pat 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 <laughs> okay and the other eyes too there i like coloring I like coloring the, that part of my eyes. Then I'm going to use this small brush to draw a line in my eyes. I don't normally use any eyeliner, but I do this. There. I already have thick eye lines, so I don't use an eyeliner anymore but i normally do this in both of my eyes to accentuate it just to accentuate this normally takes two to three minutes both the eyeshadow and the eye line in both of my eyes so this is very critical as well because if if you mess it mess it up you have to repeat it again there and then the other eye yeah it's very hard <laughs> i know so this completes the 50 percent of get ready with me all right there you go <laughs> so next thing that we will do is next thing we will do is put on blush on so this is the highlighter, the blush on, and also this uh, top one is a eye shadow that you can use for blush on as well. So we'll use the topmost, the pink one there. So you just have to smile and find your cheeks, <laughs> your cheekbone. There you go. Just top, 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 top there you do the same thing on your other cheekbone and then after you do this you know the second circle i normally use that one for highlighter because it's more to the color is nude and it's near to my skin tone there let's do this highlighter so it's just a light highlighter in my face there you go there ta-da almost done for my lips i only use lip ice or lip balm 
or lip tint or oil in color now let's use lip eyes um, to accentuate my lips a little there Ta-da! There it is. My finished product. Get ready with me, face. <laughs> my makeup routine is done and my hair is also done. And I had it uh, permed last time. There you go. So it's been like that for a month now. So that's it for my get ready with me vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and thank you very much for watching the video till the very end. Bye for now. Love you guys. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs>